everyone, welcome. We're going to be playing some Hell Sign. The game I saw someone playing on YouTube and it looked pretty interesting. I'm Syndicate 57 and let's get this started. We're going to start a new game. I did have a new char character before. Uh, I'm just going to play. We're going to start a new character. Hmm. What should we. I want to be this badass guy right here. Let's see. What's my name? Oh, uh, let's see. Syndicate. Don't mind me. I can't write. I mean, I can write. I just can't type. How about that? Uh, so you can be a detective. Let's see. We got detective and you got the equipment here. Um, so you have better skills for finding clues, trying to avoid decapitation. Ooh. Really? Sees everything in useful information. Even when it's meaningless uh, detail, has developed a terrible habit of talking to himself and answering back. <laughs> uh, yeah, I kind of do that, actually. But uh, special deduction investigation using high-tech gadgets. Okay. Um, stalker. One more trophy, one more rare find. None of them fill the empty hole in his heart where that special person no longer resides. The money is, money is starting to. Uh, specialty, or speciality, is baits, grenades, and traps. Hmm. See here. Um, mercenary. It's not that he doesn't care. He cares very much about the money and the booze. Just not about you. Either help with moving the body or get out of the way. Speciality: uh, aggressive combatant. I think I'm going with this, and I I think that this is what I chose originally when I tried the game out just to see uh, you know if I liked it. Seems pretty cool. The, ga the game's it's it's a little get used to though. Um, there's a lot to it. Uh, let's see what else they have. Renegade. There's a reason he is the way he is. The dirty bastard. No one will ever find out those reasons. Relevancies died off years ago with the people who knew what they were. Gambling is a specialty. Um, Breacher doesn't need to act like a badass. He knows who he is. He's the first guy in that uh, through that door. Alone or not, he's the one charging through the hallway. Fuck whatever might get in his way. Okay, and he's heavily armored. Oh, he does start with a heavy armor. Oh. Okay. Field medic. Uh, who has time for med school when beasts roam day and night alike? He certainly didn't. Besides, he always found it easier to learn by working on living, twitching, uh, jerking tissue that reading from a book than reading from a book. Wow. Apparently I haven't had much coffee. Use of medkits and extra health. Hmm. Man, I gotta wake up a little bit, huh? Let's see. This is the archaeologist. The art lover would be relic collector. Prefers digging up old bones to laying bones to rest. Doesn't mind breaking a few along the way. Treasure hunting is a specialty. Hmm. Ooh, ninja. Got stabbed in the back once and only once. After coming to, decided it was an effective way of living and adopted the technique. Dodging and assassination equipment. Drifter. Once the world told him to fuck off somewhere and die, he's still working on the dying part, but the rest has been surprisingly fulfilling. His only regret? Memories of consistently uh, uh, better food. <laughs> uh, I could play the guitar. Okay. We're going with Mercenary. I like the the combat. This game definitely feels like you're going to need combat skills. We're, we'll go through the tutorial. Because we're just going to play it. We'll eat you from the inside. I'm fucked. This must be hell. A nightmare. How am I still alive? Where? No. Who am I? I should be dead, or at least it felt like it. Not to mention this weird-ass tattoo. Hmm, still fresh. Feels fresh. Must have been one hell of a party. Hey, you. The scout I talked to? The address is... Some weird about a job. Sure beats staying in this dump. Hold on a 
second. The only thing I don't like about the game is when your character does like this little like motion blur. Are you the scout we spoke to? <laughs> yeah, mate, it's time is money, so let's get cracking. You rip us. So they had some difficulty in that freaking day. Can we believe phantoms are wrong? But don't worry about it, mate. That's our job. Okay, so what do you need me to do? Like we spoke over the phone, we need you to scout the house for any paranormal signs and activity. And when you're done, head back over here with any signs you find so we can figure out what we're up against. Oh yeah, and before you get started, you might want to search the pits nearby for hidden signs. Love your decorating. Really good. Uh, equip a tool, uh, which is three or four. Okay, so the EMF. Yeah, I know it doesn't work your time goes. Ooh. Sounds like it's coming from here. Yep. There we go. Take the signals back to Banjo. Yeah, your character looks blurry when he's like moving. Weird. Wonder if I can go into like the settings of NVIDIA and it increase the uh, refresh rate in the game. 
So how'd he go, mate? Let's you some signs. Tenants were his lucky. I hear you, man. Do you believe the outside? Man. Guess it's time to whip out your cryptonomicon and figure out what we're up against here. Press J to view your cryptonomicon. Yeah, mate. Leave it with me. Drag your evidence, uh, evidence signs into the deduction. Uh, here's your clue. So it's looks like glass or something. So look up. Uh, Structural right there. Hmm. And you gotta look for the one that looks the same. Ooh. Okay, so this one looks like it's a battle. It's a lot of years last time I trusted the new guy in town. Let's just say it didn't end well. Hmm. Guess I'm sure. I'm never a cocky little bastard, aren't we? I like that. Listen, we gotta finish up this job before we go. But you can bugger off. Hey, where's my pay for the job? Look, we got our hands full here, so I'll tell you what. Head back to town and find the shaggy jackal down on Bailey Road. I'll meet you there once I'm done with this phantom and we can sort out your pay. job. This game is a lot about combat, so that's why I chose the mercenary. And here's your map for your stuff. I've only got done like the tutorial pretty much. I haven't really gotten too far into the game on my other game, so definitely a uh, fun game so far. So go to the bar. All right, well, here's the bar. And these are the like, people you can interact with. So we need to find Banjo. Here he is, looking snazzy. What's up? Who are you? You're joking, right? Where's my damn money? Wow, calm down, mate. I'll sort you out. Don't worry about that. You see that sh shady person in the corner there? With the black hoodie and the crappy shades? That's Redback. Those signs you found? Well, you can get some serious cash from selling to him. Is he a merchant? A fixer, more like. Yeah, don't let the missing ear and uh, shitty ass appearance fool you. He's sharper than Ninja's knife. That one's word to the wise, watch your back around him. Last time we made a deal, he cheated me out of five grand and my cat. My cat, mate. What kind of bastard takes another man's cat? So this is right back. I know you. You don't look like you're from around here. I was told you signed. You're a cop? Who the fuck sent you? Reaches for his gun. Nah, man, relax. Who the fuck sent you? How do you know about me? Chill, man. Banjo sent me. Oh, Banjo. You should have said so. I haven't played cards with that guy in ages. How much did he tell you about me? <laughs> Not a lot, but he says you cheated him out of five grand and a cat. First of all, he wasn't even taking proper care of the cat, and I didn't cheat him on anything. Man's got a terrible poker face. Now that we cleared that up, I deal with underground stuff and I only deal with cash, none of that debit card bullshit. So if you're looking to pawn off anything paranormal, I'm the guy to see around here. So you got the signs? Let's trade. Holy danger cash, my ass. Head back to your safe house. Mm, okay. Let's go to our safe house. Looks pretty, pretty crappy. Alright, let's go use J to read your cryptonomicon. Okay. I don't know. I need to. Cryptids. 
you to access your skills. Oh, yeah, right, you get skills. I haven't even unlocked any of these yet. The other game, when I tried playing. So you got, like, investigation skills, basic tools, artifact specialist, audio file, you know, stuff that'll increase your skills as a, a paranormal investigator. Uh, parazoology. <laughs> you got gun skills, sidearms, and then primary weapons. Survival, like you can upgrade your first aid training, and then you have like, like um, accessories, throwable, trapper, ninjutsu, sleight of hand. Now, a lot, some of these skills are required to use certain things you can buy, like equipment. So, um, pretty cool. I like it. Now let's clip on the crafting. This is the crafting table. Can actually make things pretty cool like you need stuff that you can make them we don't have anything so we just need to access head back to the bar uh, let's talk to banjo hey mate what's up looking for some work can you hook me up oh really i can think of some work right up your alley Looks at you. Oh gosh. Hey, what do you have in mind? There are a bunch of jobs going around town and I can hook you up for sure. I need to ask a favor from you first. I need you to head to a small shop downtown just off Parksville Road. It's a little place called Guns and Baits. You should see a puzzle box sitting in the front window. Get that for me and I will hook you up with any job you want. Alright. Thanks, mate. You're a legend. Now he just unlocked the gun store for us. Hey mate, what can I do you for? Let's see, guns of course, and just about everything else you may need. The from heavy tactical vest, spectral traps. You name it, we got it. So I take it you're new to this town. The name's Noah. You're a hunter? Nah, I'm a scout. Oh yeah, could use a few more special invest specialist investigators in town. You'd be glad to know a fresh shipment of the latest gear just arrived last night. We got parabolic mics, thermal detectors, uh, incan incandescent torches, and loads more. Let me know if you need anything. Or help with anything. So, here's guns. You can buy guns. There's attachment. You got different types of ammo. Which I'm going to buy. We have a little machine gun and it burns ammunition. No. Uh, is it a puzzle box. That's all I needed from this guy. Back to the bar. Go back to Banjo. Well, fuck me, you actually managed to get it. You're a legend. You have no idea how rare these are. Now I can finally head south and take care of that damn cold priest. Anyway, I introduced you to Noah, and now you got me a puzzle box, so we're even now. You bastard, at least tell me where I can get some work around here. All right. I guess I owe you at least that much. Your pal Redback is always looking for new recruits, but don't get sucked into his bullshit. Oh, he's gonna have a job. Hey, by the way, you were any good with guns? Yes, I am. Why yes? I got this job downtown. Not too far from here on Tin Alley Road. Nothing too serious. Just a few small cryptids to clean up. You interested? 350 smackers and 15 XP? Huh? Yeah. Hell yeah, hook me up. Okay, so once you're there, clear out the house and make sure you do a good job. The last few runners have been lazy as fuck and they're killing my reputation here. When it's done, head back over here and I'll fix you up. Alright. Clear house. Sweeping contract. So sweeping contract. Do this.
All right, equip your gun. Yeah. Now, here's your inventory. See, this gun uses regular ammo. This is incendiary ammo. I'm going to throw that on there just in Click, shoots your gun. Face does a dodge. All right, equip your weapon and kick open the door. Oh, okay. Do this. Clear the house of all the threats. can't investigate. That's right. Okay. Maybe I can't go there? Oh! Oh, shoot! I wonder if there's another way to kill them. Of course there is. Locate a corpse and use a black light. Okay. We know there's a corpse at the front door over here. See, so you got your. You can do like analysis, as Bathmit tells you. Locate the analyzed cryptic, cryptid and walk to the door. Okay. I did there ooh, something over there what I did there is who can analyze a body and it gives you clues to what kind of uh, what kind of thing you're hunting oh, what house is it is it this room the door oh geez mama moron look open cryptonomicon oh, we're looking at cryptids now this is what it said we got albino spiders medium sized but uncommon australian jumping spider that includes various house pets such as uh, poodles and terriers the albino spider relies on jumping attacks to engage threats it's usually solitary but sometimes hunts in pairs in which case a ignited petrol trap will dispose of them with ease they also respond well to meatballs in incendiary rounds, but like most arachnids, are resistant. Uh, Macabish. I don't know if I'm saying that wrong. Don't worry. So what I'm gonna do? So seven is petrol. petrol. Oh damn it! Who is your pistol? So now see how the doors open. Did it die? Oh yeah. Okay, it's dead. So now I have to clear the whole house and see how all the doors are open now. I don't know if there's anything in here. 
Archie, it's fine, bud. Scared me. Okay. Anyone else here? All right, nothing there. Gotta be at least one more. Because we have not cleared the house. Are we missing something here? Did I miss a room? Anybody? Oh, oh yeah, I did. Big chance for you. You must live on. I don't know if you're supposed to survive that. Talk to Redback. Hmm. Right. Yeah, I'm not sure if you're supposed to survive that. Holy shit, he lives. Never thought I'd see you again, much less on two legs. What are you talking about? Dude, I found you in the shadow dimension with shadow beasts all over you. Any longer, there wouldn't have been anything left to find. Those little things were shadow beasts. Yeah, mate. You want to steer clear of those. Nasty fuckers are all over shadow realm. Sometimes they even come through to our di dimension. Wait, that reminds me. Sorry about that. Why didn't you tell me uh, you had a fucking hell sign? What hell sign? You know, the massive occult tattoo on your back that turns you into a magnet for the supernatural. What were you thinking, you idiot? I had no idea what a hell sign is. Shit, you're serious. A hell sign is what allows us hunters to summon and hunt supernaturals. One sec. Scribble something on in the back of the newspaper. Here, just make a mark like this on the floor and say those words. It will allow you to invoke phantoms, like the one we found earlier. Why would I get uh, the hell sign in the first place? Beats me. Sorry, man. I'm out of time here. Already uh, late for a hot date with some twin sisters. 
just so you know, this doesn't look good for you. I'd seriously avoid telling people you got that mark for now. Wait, what are you doing in the shadow dimension anyway? Oh, um, my puzzle box went missing. And since you're the one who uh, bought it, I went looking for you. See, uh, it's this weird tendency to make its way back to its owner. Uh, anyway, next minute I found you lying there in a pile of shit. Like a pile of shit. And the rest is history. Anyway, mate, I'm getting out of here and heading down to Melbourne. Catch you then, flip side. Huh. In deep concentration scribbling, uh, ancient characters on, on the paper and muttering to herself, the only explanation we can do is Wendigo blood. Um. I like this one. Are you a magician here? Or everyone else just. Okay. So well, he's gone. You sure took your time on that job. I spent three fucking days. What? Uh, where have you been? Uh, I was busy getting shafted by a fucking shadow beast. Told me it was a regular job. You calling me a liar? There's nothing special about that job, so you must have fucked up somewhere along the way. Anyway, I'm, I'm assuming you cleared the house because the client isn't playing yet. So consider the job done, but as late as the taking 90% of the cut. Next job. Be the fuck on time. Ooh, what a bad. Spiffing me. There's always a few jobs going on in town, and I could use some extra hands, so I'll hook you up. Oh, and the word on the street is you have a hell sign. You might want to keep that under wraps. Well, I'm not just anyone now, am I? Anyway, since we are going to work together, I'll help you out on this one. Free time, uh, time free of charge. This is a chick who's always hanging around the bar. I think her name's Zoe or something. I'll uh, warn you, mate. She's not the full biscuit, if you know what I mean. But she is your best bet if you want some answers. Alright. Well, we're going to go ahead and end this video here. Um, if you like the game, uh, let me know. Uh, it looks pretty interesting. It's a fun game. I know it was a little bit more of uh, tutorial time this time, but I'm going to keep playing that. So uh, look for the next video. I had fun, and uh, if you like, like, please like the video and uh, subscribe to see the next one. Thank you. Bye-bye. Thanks for watching. If you liked what you saw, please leave a like. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel so you don't miss any new content. And don't forget, check out my Twitch channel. I do like to stream from time to time. Stay safe out there.